Good finger. Be able to put oh. It hurt. Let's see if we can do something about it. Let's get this cut covered up. Yes, please. said you killed someone. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? It's complicated. Very Sometimes complicated. things happen and you do things and you can't explain them. Let's uh, head back to the others. We can't let anything happen to Ducky. I know, hon. It's not much, but here. For the yeah. boy. Oh, thanks, Lee. He appreciates it. That's sweet, Lee. Hey there. Uh, this is Glenn, and uh, I'm kind of in a jam here. Uh, little girl, if you're there, can you put your daddy on the phone? Or on the talkie, or whatever? This is Lee. What's up? So, I'm down at that motor inn, and... Well, uh, I'm stuck. Stuck? Yeah, I, uh, uh, saw a chance to get some supplies for the group. And a bunch of the Roman ones got the jump on me. I'm hiding over here, but they won't leave. What's up? Glenn's trapped down at the motor inn. Hey, Glenn. We're gonna talk it over and send a group to come get you, alright? Awesome. I'll sit tight till then. Sounds good. I'm gonna hold on to this until we get Glenn back, okay? I'll take good care of it. What do you think? I think Doug's not great around zombies. And you got your family here. I'll take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor inn, get Glenn, and get back here as fast as I can. If that's what you want to do, somebody's got to. Yeah, I'm in. Good. Doesn't sound too bad there right now. Let me know as soon as you want to head out. I could use a jog. Radio. I can't get it to work though. Yeah. Here, let me have a look. Radio killed radio stuff. She didn't put batteries in. There are no batteries in this thing. What now? Do you know that there are no batteries in that thing? Yeah, of course. I mean, yeah. No. I can try to find so some. Dumb. Needs two. <laughs> Thanks. I wouldn't even really know what to look for. We just need to get back to Fort Lauderdale. We'll do our damnedest. Battery should fit the radio. Great, thanks. I'm still looking for batteries for that thing. Thanks, I appreciate it. Thanks, No, I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead guards. <laughs> Quite like that. 
got to be keys somewhere. Try to get some rest, hon. How can I with those things out there? It's all melted now. It's all melted now. Hey, Lee. Maybe punching him wasn't such a good idea. There were worse plans. Says the guy who didn't get punched in the mouth. Anyway, we, Kat and I, appreciate your support. Thank you, Lee. I was duck to her. It's okay. It was just a shock. We're lucky as hell nobody got nabbed on the way in here. No kidding. How's she doing? She's good, I think. She's a tough one right there. She's just a little girl, Ken. What are you saying, Lee? She spent days surviving on her own? That's right. Not just any little girl can do that. Are you guys all right? Oh, we're just fine, considering. How about you, Duck? We've all been through a lot. What's the plan? Hang tight, I suppose. Seems pretty dangerous out there, so we ought to wait for things to clear up. You said your family was from here in Macon? That's right. Where are they? Should we go looking for them? No. They're uh, gone. Oh my goodness. Do you think? How? I just know, all right? Cat, it's not our business. Silly. Lee, you got a second? Sure. Back on Herschel's farm. Yeah. Panicked, you know. I'm not proud of it. It happens. I guess. But I can't stop seeing him in my head. Yeah, that's rough. I killed that boy. We could have saved him together. You didn't have a choice. You think you do when you look back on it. But in a moment, when things are really out of control, you don't have any choice. I guess. Try to let it go. I should look out like kind of the bar of it, kind of like I know what you did. It's not much, but here. You sure? Yeah. You're under quite a bit of stress. Thanks. That's, uh, really sweet. Don't mention it. How's he doing? I'm not sure I got your name. It's Lee. Lily. Yeah. My dad's Larry. I was just doing what I had to earlier. Everyone okay. was. Now his heart's acting up again and I'm powerless to do anything. And that violence before with my dad, that didn't help. What's wrong with him? He's got a heart condition. He takes nitroglycerin tablets pretty regularly. I've seen a few bad attacks that he couldn't get over and needed to go to the hospital. Yeah, that's uh, not really an option right now. I'm just trying to keep him relaxed. He's got a temper. Ah, fuck you! Yeah, he doesn't mean it. It's just that... Yeah? We've got kids here. Family. He and I are a family. I'm just saying some people can't handle a temper like that. Hell, barely seems like you can. It's just yep. his way. Don't make him the reason everything's screwed. It is the reason. He's the Where's her mom? Us. Savannah, I think. Oh, you guys aren't together. Oh, uh, no, I'm not her dad. I found in a house when getting out of Atlanta. She'd been surviving by herself. I think the girl's parents didn't make it. Oh. I heard an answering message. They were in Savannah. She was home with a sitter. It wasn't good. Well, she's lucky to have you. You're from here? I work at Warner Robins, the Air Force Base. Yeah, I know it. Pilot? Nah, just mechanical admin stuff. 
I deal with a bunch of shitheads and bureaucrats all day. Sometimes a plane, if I'm lucky. You? I work up at UTA. Was anyone here when you guys got here? No, this place was pretty wrecked. We pulled a couple of bodies out of the office. Are you okay? Oh, shit. Yeah, I'm fine. Did you know anybody here? Yeah, the owners, they were, uh, we were close. I'm sorry. We found an older couple in the office. Dad hauled them out in case they weren't really dead. What do you think about all this? What is there to think? The dead are up, when walking around, eating people, and turning them into more... more of them. I mean, Jesus. We need to stick together and get through this. I'm gonna get back to him. Sounds good. Track down the keys if we're gonna help Larry. Heard or seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? <laughs> I'm not suicidal yet. No, the gate out there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Oh, huh. huh. Sure, uh, let's go have a look around. Cool, and we'll keep it down. Don't need to bring them back this way with any unnecessary noises. Agreed. Back is one of them. How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. Hey man, what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. Hey man, what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. Let me go. Hey man, what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. Yeah, that's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. Actually, it's pretty smart. Think you can do anything with this? You know what I could do? What's that? It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. Okay. I just hope the power is still on. Should you can just do that? Well, it's not well, I memorized all the codes when I was in AV. Let's try it. Fucking done, Doug. All that dork nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? Not got a few of them to take. 
take notice. But not enough. There's nothing good on. Those TVs are on, and I'm sure they're making a lot of noise behind that glass. Man, that's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. Something to do. Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. Just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. You wouldn't need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. Those TVs are on, and I'm sure they're making a lot of noise behind that glass. I know, Doc. I can't reach that reach brick. That brick. Can't reach it right there. Those things like TV. Or at least the sound of it. If they were louder, we might be able to clear the street. I can't reach that brick. I've got to knock that lock off of there. Imagine going out the back door and around is out of the question. If we're gonna help Larry, we need to get this lock off of there. Yeah. Such a bitch, but. Um, must be something to do. But they won't let me back. How'd you end up here? I moved here to live with my uncle. He does tech stuff and it just made sense. So you're local. You probably knew the owners of this place. No, not really. I've only been here a couple months and I spend a lot of time... On the computer? No, computer. just doing my own thing. What about you? I grew up here. Been trying to get home since the day I came back. Oh, so you probably knew the owners then? Yeah, I did. Good people. A few seconds of searching and we'll know if he has the keys. 
Man, that's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. Can't reach that brick. Let's head back inside. Okay. <laughs> he was very like against that. He's just like, okay. Let's get away. You're a pretty good shot. Well, you don't fuck with a reporter, especially one that's three days out from her last cup of coffee. All right. I better get back to it. Yep. Thanks, by the way. Don't mention it. Just remember what I said. Yeah, I will. I'm gonna get back to him. Sounds good. There's nothing I need in here. Looks like nobody got a chance to donate anything before this all went down. Central High Tech State. Papers a week old. Feels like years. Hey, Carly. You seem to handle yourself pretty well. <laughs> really? I'm a disaster. I can't tell. My news editor was eaten about five feet away from me, and I would have joined her if it wasn't for that dorky guy on watch over there. I'm sorry. She was an asshole, but, you know. Yeah. That guy saved you? Yeah. Can you believe it? Those creeps, or, or ghouls, or whatever the hell they are. They were pulling our van apart, and that guy, Doug, just came to the rescue. You can never tell who the heroic ones are gonna be, I suppose. He's kinda cute. In that parent's basement sort of way. Huh? Huh? Oh, nothing. How'd you end up here? We drove up to cover the Cherry Blossom Festival. Real hard-hitting stuff. Sounds worth it. You ready to head out? You got it. You? Yeah. 
Let's go. things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trapped up there. No way. We gotta go now. Listen, I was out here looking for gas, and then up there in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked and she got frightened. I was trying to get in and help her and she started yelling and saying I was bitten. I tried to convince her I wasn't, and that's when all these guys came out of the forest. A couple almost got me, and I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Lucky you. Now let's go. We can't just leave her. Damn right we can. You guys are suicidal over a girl. I'm saving her, with or without you. Think about if it was you. Fine. Let's go save Glenn's damsel in distress. As far as I got when it came to supply gathering. I might have an idea for it. Good luck smothering them to death. That's not really what I have in mind. Old problem. We're a little naked out here, except for Carly's gun, and we can't use that much. Let's head back to that wall. Safe there. I'm not sure I can take them both out myself, even if I had a weapon. Let's head back to that wall. Safe there. Get into that room. I think I found a pretty damn good way to stop these guys quietly. Now we just have to get it quietly. What are you gonna do with that? I don't really know. Do you have any tricks for getting into cars? Not without tools, or making a bunch of noise, and none with pillows. Ow! Hey man, that drew some attention. Be careful. I'm done trying to punch out windows. Get out your gun. But the noise. 